Three Columbus police officers now defend their actions during downtown protests after the murder of George Floyd in the summer of 2020. Sergeant Holly Canote is one of three officers going to trial based on accusations about how police responded to demonstrators. NBC4 investigates Jamie Ostroff has been following the special prosecutor's investigation and was the only reporter in the Franklin County Municipal Courtroom today. Jamie. Well, Jennifer, Sergeant Holly Canote is charged with falsification and dereliction of duty, all stemming from what you are about to see here. This is cell phone video from May 30th, 2020. It shows a protester being yanked to the ground by an officer. Now, that officer is not Canode, but according to special prosecutor Kathleen Garber, Canode claimed multiple times that the protester had yanked the officer to the ground and that resulted in the protester's arrest. Garber is building her case largely around this cell phone video showing the protester did not assault the officer. Canode's defense team, however, argues what we see in this bystander video is irrelevant. Attorneys Mark Collins and Caitlin Stevens say Garber simply cannot prove what Canode saw or what she thought she saw amid the chaos of the protests. She knows that her words are being used to send Miss Lynch to jail. They will not be able to produce for you a scintilla of proof with respect to the mental elements associated with these two charges. Now these were opening statements. All of the arguments today and moving forward are being made directly to the judge and that is because Canode waived her right to a jury today. Now coming up on NBC4 at 6, we're going to hear from that protester who was arrested and later had those charges dropped. Local for you in Columbus, Jamie Ostroff, NBC4.